Okay, well then let me, I wrote down some lines. Uh, maybe you can say, just say if it's correct or not. Mm -hmm. uh, burden, I, I think it's the last verse because I, I like the verse, well, mm -hmm. that verse the most. Uh, if death should take me now, count my mistakes and let me through. Whisper in my ear, you've taken more than we've received and the ocean of sorrow is you. Mm -hmm. That's right. That's a quick. Okay, is it, um, can I ask questions about it? Or no. You say, okay, well, you can ask, but I won't ask. Yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> um, okay. Um, can I say that this has something to do with, uh, um, um, well, once, once you died and you have, let's say, you have certain things that you have, uh, well, that you've given to other ones and that you've received. Is it something, something to do with balances in life when you die? In a way, you know, some of these songs, Burden is connected with Hessian Peel. Uh, and to some extent, Porcelain Heart, but mostly Hessian Peel. It, I got, I wrote these lyrics based on a person that I used to know that committed suicide. And when did he or she commit suicide? Was it I heard it when we were in the studio, actually. So I got a call from somebody. I used to be I actually. I used to, to uh, go out with this. It was a girl. I used to go out with a long time ago. But did did you speak to her? <laughs> no, I had, I hadn't seen her. You know, we weren't friends anymore. We weren't not friends. We weren't like, uh, you know. But we broke up a long time ago. It was over twelve twelve years ago, I think. And we were just together for a brief amount of time and. Since I didn't, you know, didn't really talk to her much. I just heard bits and pieces of what was going on in her lives, but I didn't really know her. But did it, what did it do to you? Was it some sort of, well, you say, something that you took in, well, re, well more lighthearted, or was it? Was it no, no, it wasn't, you know, it was, I can't, I don't want to talk too much about it, but it was, it, I knew what was going on a little bit in her life, although I didn't really have any contact with her. Mm -hmm. But uh, there was just, uh, she was depressed or something. Yeah, she was a very, you know, depressed person. But she, she, uh, once I heard she, you know, there was disputes whether she committed suicide or if it was an accident, you know. And it was just one of those things that uh, it's kind of weird when people in your that you had known die, dies. You know, it's it's. Uh, it, uh, and, and every time it happened in my life that people die, I've always written lyrics. Deliverance and Damnation, my grandmother yeah. and grandfather died. Uh, and uh, Morning Rise, my other grandfather died for the, <coughs> excuse me, Night in the Silent Water I wrote by him. So it's always inspiring. Uh, and uh, I, obviously I didn't see it as a good thing. Oh, finally I get some inspiration, you know. But it did inspire me, and there was also certain things about her life that I knew about that made me feel uh, I could relate to her life a little bit, and also um, um, kind of, how do you say, um, it was easy for me to put it into words, I guess. Because you knew her. I knew her. I didn't know. Well, by the time she died. No, but I mean. I did know her. Yeah. I did know her. But, but by the time she died, we, never, we were never in touch anymore. 